I'm going, man, before you take advantage. Yard. Why? It's half my house. Now, I'm gonna call the police. For what? Disloyalty, boy. Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy. Yo, you ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old man, ignoring your homies, acting all superior. Your mama will turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbanger? Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. The up. Yeah, shut the fuck up! Here, darling, why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Oh, thank you! <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stress thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Man, just come on. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you in stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you in stress concern. Man, this is a... This is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust... Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. This the homie house right here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, all right? Listen, they putting another game together. Five card. Usual chumps. You in? It's a G to buy in, homie. I'm thinking if we do our thing. Hey, be on point. This fool janky. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. Mm -hmm. My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. 
How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me, give me the, give me the back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. Damn, you can't fucking hustle a hustler. Fuck ah. Motherfucker. Man, you ain't cut off this shit. These punks ain't leaving Grove Street. Lame ass. Get money, homie. Homie, that's our way up out of here. Put your fucking hands up. 
I don't care who you is, you get jacked. Christ! What the fuck are you doing? Hey, they taking clip shit! Come on, come on! Damn, it's stinking this motherfucker! Shit ain't no river, man! It's a motherfucker! Sewer! Then we're in the right place!
I'm Don't be no wild ass yeah. punk, now give me that. Ah. You crackhead! Man, fuck this shit. Damn degenerate! You picked the wrong guy. What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude outsourced work to child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. 
and even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planning lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new mollus, sort of a super mollus, and it's called Priapolds. It's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA. Now, he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond. Of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using mollus, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man. All right. Fuck it. I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs. You know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm going to make the investment. We don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone.
Let's move it out, people! We need this area cleared! Keep your eye out for anything unusual. Let's see if we can get through one day without some wannabe hippie waving an anti-globalization sign in my face. Get what you give out, Mr. Lowry. It's done. I know. Good work. All right. Well, shit. Let me know about the next thing. Will do. Uh, but before that, I've got to tell you something. Our investment portfolio is getting a little, uh, successful. So I figured we needed some tangible assets and property. So we bought a house in the Vinewood Hills. Yeah, sure, man. Whatever. You know best about this shit. And we needed someone to live there you know, for tax purposes. So some guys are moving your stuff in. Oh, shit. Meaning I don't have to live with my crazy ass aunt no more? Man, I don't know what the fuck to say, dawg. Don't say anything, especially if a man in a suit comes to the door. Ah, I'm joking, that probably isn't gonna happen. It's yours, enjoy it. 3671 Wispy Mound Drive. Hey. Oh, please.
You watch that Republican Space Rangers? I love that show! You look like you're fuming. Best time to make weaponry decisions. I'll bet you'll be ready to use that the second you get out the door. I killed a dolphin with one of those. Well, the breakdown of society is inevitable, friend. Hope you'll be ready. Oh, I'll give you a good deal on that. You've racked up... ...in rewards points.
We should chill some time. Okay, you know Redwood cigarettes? Sure, the cigarette that built America. They've rigged a jury to throw a class action lawsuit that would cover the treatment costs of thousands of emphysema sufferers. Now, there are four corrupt jurors on Redwood's books. I'll send you the details. Oh, and we only have a few hours to make them disappear. The court case is tomorrow morning. Is that all, dog? Shit, that's quite a favor. And that's quite a house you're living in. Get this done quickly, and I'll try to throw in a sweetener as well. Now, I'd advise picking up some long-range hardware to get this job done. You'll be helping a lot of people with this, Franklin, including anyone who might have a sizable investment in, say, uh, debonair cigarettes. Get down or lay down. Ain't nothing personal.
Alter, Presse! I ain't got much time left. Even think of a pilot? I don't want any scrap. Wow, great car. Shit is worse than war. Spending two hundred dollars on vintage footwear is anti-capitalism. Moron. How's this? Shit, my son. Oh, fuck! Oh.
Damn, I ain't got much time left. Hey, L, it's done, homie. All of them. Very good. I'll be in touch. 